February is Career and Technical Education Month, which highlights programs dedicated to providing students the hands-on experience they need post-graduation. One local CTE program right here in Houston is hosted by Centerpoint Energy. And joining me to talk more about their opportunities is Teresa Sauls and Dr Jason Greer with Centerpoint Energy. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. So tell me, what is Career and Technical Education Month? Um, Career and Technical Edu Education Month is a time set aside to showcase the importance of CTE. Um, as we know, CTE provides students with real-world 21st century skills that make them ready, college and career ready. Okay, and Jason, can you tell me when did the Centerpoint Energy CTE program start and, and what kind of impact has it made so far? Sure, since I've been in training, uh, I've, we've been doing it about five years now. Teresa can shed a little bit more light on it. Mm -hmm. I know that the company has been involved with the CTE programs for many years. Yeah, Teresa, yeah. so what's the impact been? So we um, have a strong connection um, with the local community, with the local school districts. Um, our CTE program connects Centerpoint Energy employees with local school campuses, educations, and students. We place employees on advisory committees um, at, our, at our CTE campuses, and we offer hands-on field trips uh, for both gas and electric operations. We participate in their career days, uh, their mock interviews, and project-based learning opportunities. We, um, it's also an opportunity for our senior management to speak with students when they're at our CMP facilities. Uh, our team, our CTE liaisons, advise our the educators and teachers on the relevancy of their instructional material mm -hmm. and it's also you know an opportunity when we encourage students to start thinking about working in the energy and utility industry right after high school um, you know helping them see that their high school diploma as a foundation for the future rather than as an end in and of itself yeah yeah that's a great idea what schools are you working in working with in our area so we're partnering with um, HISD, um, A-Leaf, Aldean, Spring Branch, Spring, uh, Galena Park, Pasadena, wow. ISD, um, Sheldon, Goose Creek. Um, we're right about 15 districts. Yeah, that's uh, a lot. Yeah, Crosby. And what's really awesome is that we have Centerpoint employees set up as liaisons for these campuses. So that's where the strong tie-ins come in, where they're, again, helping the instructors and teachers uh, provide relevant instructional material to the schools, to the students, and, and just really help us strengthen those partnerships. Yeah. Jason, what's been the part that you've enjoyed doing the most? I think the most thing I enjoy about going to the campus is getting the uh, word spread out about the utility industry in itself. Um, you know, when I came up uh, as a lineman, if you didn't know a lineman, you just didn't know what the utility industry was. So us mm -hmm. getting boots on the ground to the high school students to let them know that there, there's other, that there's this other career path out there that they can be very successful in, albeit on the gas or electric side. Yeah. It just gives them another avenue here in the city to pursue for a career. Yeah, helping to provide that direction to some of them who might have an interest in this, but really not even know what to do with that interest. So yeah, I think that's wonderful. And I heard that you guys were recently at Santa Fe High School. Can you tell me a little bit more about that? Sure, we just had a collaborative visit with the gas and electric side at Santa Fe, which was a very successful event. Cool story about Santa Fe, we have about 10 employees that graduated from the Santa Fe High School and went through oh, their wow. CTE program that work at our Galveston Service Center, uh, which is a neat thing to, yeah, that's to, great. to uh, you know. Yeah, no, that's great. You must be really, really proud of that. And so then you want to keep going back to schools like that where you know that those students might have an interest. And, may, and like you said, they might then know somebody who then they would actually know that, they, that that's a career field they want to pursue. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, Jason Greer and Teresa Sauls, I'm going to let you go soon, but do you have anything else that you'd like viewers to know about, about CTE? Anything that you'd like to say? 
Um, I, I would like to share some other initiatives that we we do with the local school districts, because um, as Jason said, providing awareness about the trades mm -hmm. is, is critical. Um, a lot of the students just don't know what they don't know. And when they get to meet someone uh, personally uh, and share those those stories about their the, the employee's career and and how they came about to, to work for the company. We um, also partner with local community colleges with Texas State T uh, Technical College, Lone Star, Sanjack, and HCC, um, as well as other nonprofit uh, partners that are involved in the workforce development, because these partnerships really serve employers and, um, and workers. And um, we provide funding um, mm -hmm. from our foundation to support the, the CTE programs. Yeah, so I love it going on. I love it. Well, thank you for the support that you provide in our community and keep doing the good work. Thank you. All right. You. Teresa and Jason, nice to have you this morning.